Hey guys, it's Nami, or should I say Nami-san, because today I'm a casual dry night because I just got these new contact lenses and I wanted to try them on with my dry night costume. Well, I don't have my whole costume at home, so I put on my wig and played with makeup a little bit, and I think it looks pretty good. <laughs> I like it. Well, I wasn't gonna do, um full face paint because usually my dranai is dark purple but yeah not messing with that at home like that like that takes hours so yeah so today I'm gonna answer the questions that you guys left me when I posted my 200 subscribers video so let's get started the first question is from Fantala she asks if you could play one genre of games for the rest of your life what would it be um Probably MMO, because if I'm gonna play only one kind of game, um, I'm probably gonna want to play with other people, and also there's like no end to MMOs, so I don't know, I feel like I wouldn't get bored of it. So yeah, probably MMO. The next question comes from Bailey. What is the scariest game you have played or want to play? Um. I think the scariest game I played was Fatal Frame. Uh, I don't remember which one it was. I think it was the first one, maybe the second one. I think it was on the Wii and <laughs> it just scared the crap out of me. I couldn't even play it really because there's these ghosts that come at you and you have to take a picture of them to capture them, but I was like panicking so much that I kept failing and I'm just I'm just really bad at aiming when I'm freaking out I think that's why I like the old Resident Evil games better because um, in Resident Evil 4 like the beginning is not that bad but then when it gets like crazy at the end it's so hard for me because I'm just panicking and I'm like trying to aim and yeah it just doesn't work out for me the next question is from Andy and he asks, are there any games you're excited for coming out? Uh, yes, I'm looking forward to the new Zelda game because we've been waiting forever. <laughs> and I also really want to play Ukulele, um, Bloodstained and Shenmue 3 because I backed them on Kickstarter and I'm really looking forward to them. So yeah. The next question is from Sid. Are you looking forward to the Nintendo Switch? And if you are, what is your favorite feature? Uh, yes, I'm looking forward to it. Um, I own every single Nintendo console. And since the GameCube, I've gotten all of them on day one. So I'm going to do the same thing again for sure. And the feature I'm the most looking forward to is probably um, the fact that you can... Um, play it on the go, like if I'm playing at home and have to go somewhere that I don't really feel like going to, I can always take my game with me and keep playing it. So yeah, really looking forward to that. Next, BMN1990 asks, what is your favorite color? Uh, blue. Uh, more specifically, sky blue. Like, yeah, this little Yoshi right here, because that's my favorite Yoshi also, because it's color is cool. <laughs> um, the Jumas asks, what cosplay took you the longest to finish? Um, definitely my Zelda costume because the armor was so long to gesso and sand and paint <laughs> and I had to, um, I had to do some weathering on it because if I just leave it gold it doesn't look very good. And then I had to varnish it, and then I had to assemble all the pieces, because it's armor, and <laughs> I I almost had like a mental breakdown trying to finish it on the last day, because I hadn't slept in like 48 hours, and I was like, I'm not gonna finish on time, I was freaking out, so I went to take a nap for like 4 or 5 hours, and I got up at midnight, like on the day of the con, and I painted all night and I finished at, I think, at 11 a.m. And then I had to get ready for the con and I 
got there a little bit late, but I made it, <laughs> as always, last minute, but yeah. The next question comes from that one rebel. What are your likes and dislikes of this current expansion? Um, honestly, I think I like pretty much everything about Legion so far. The only thing I don't like, and I've made a video about it, is that they removed traps from hunters, they removed um, trank shot, they removed, uh, well, they changed aspect of the cheetah and it's now a three minute cooldown um, instead of like constant 30% and I don't know it's just a bunch of things that they removed from hunters that I'm not happy about but at BlizzCon they said that they were gonna give us our traps back I don't know when probably 7.2 but um, they know they fucked up and I think overall it's a really good expansion probably the best one since I started playing I think so far Phenom Uprising asks, could you play a game that so you know well you could, you would, you said, no nah, you would, you could play a game that you, that could do anything. I see what you did there. Um, the next question comes from Aurora Tlaloc, I don't know if I'm pronouncing it properly, if I'm not I'm sorry. Um, I was wondering where you're from and what language you can speak. Your accent is so cool. Congratulations on all the subs and also your hair is super pretty. Thank you. Um, I'm from Canada and I speak French so my accent is a French Canadian accent. So yeah. Metagross Go asked, what's your favorite game? Um, <sighs> Usually I always say Ocarina of Time because I don't know like when I think about that game I feel like It's just a perfect game like I don't see anything Wrong with it. I think it's the only game that I can think of that There's no flaws really. I Don't know. It's just it's just such a good game and I've always really loved it and yeah, so probably a care enough time, but if um I guess it's hard to like talk about my favorite game and not mention World of Warcraft because I've been playing it for a very long time and I haven't gotten sick of it and I don't know, I just really love the lore and everything. So I guess like if we're talking single player games, I would say A Care Enough Time. And if we're talking like multiplayer online games, I would say World of Warcraft. And if I add also my favorite series in there, I would say Ace Attorney because all the games in the series are good. And I don't know, like, I mean, there's one in particular that I don't like as much, but it's not a bad game. It's just, um,. I don't know, it's just me and like not liking the story, I guess, in that particular game. But I mean, I just really like the characters and the story in general and the humor. So yeah, I really like that series. So yeah. Next we have Steven Newman who has five questions for me. Uh, first question, what is your favorite cosplay that you've done and what is one that you are excited about doing in the future? Uh, my favorite cosplay is this one. Well, it looks better when I have like the armor and like not like a tiger shirt. <laughs> I actually made my guild tabard for my costume. I'll go get it actually. So this is the tabard that I made with the my guild logo. It's just the eye. <laughs> um. Yeah, because my guild is called Umbrella Corporation, because I don't like Resident Evil, apparently. And yeah, so this is my guild tabard, and I chose the eye because there's nothing that looks like an umbrella, really. And it reminded me of the eye from the Birkin's arm in Resident Evil 2, so yeah, that's why I picked this logo. It's pretty long because it's a tabard. It goes down to my knees and on the back, can't really see, there's a hole <laughs> for the tail because I have a tail on my costume, obviously, because I'm a Draenei. So yeah, that's my guild tabard. So yeah, favorite costume. 
It would look better if I did purple makeup, but it's too much for me today. And I'm gonna put pictures here of my full costume in case you guys haven't seen it. So yeah, that's my favorite costume. And second part of the question is, uh, what is one that you're excited about doing in the future? Um, there's a bunch that I want to do. I want to do um, Kurisu from Steins Gate. That's kind of an easy one. Uh, what else? I'd like to do Jaina, but I don't know which version yet. Probably the new one with the white hair. Um, there's also more Ace Attorney characters that I want to do. I already did three of them. <laughs> But yeah, probably one of those. Uh, second question. If you could sing a duet with one person, who would it be and what would the song be? Um, I already actually sang a duet on my other channel with my friend Midi Guy. Uh, we sang um, I See the Light from Tangled. If I were to record another duet, it would probably be with him again because I really like singing with him. And I'd really like to do... Uh, Love is an Open Door from Frozen. I don't know, I just really like <laughs> Disney songs for some reason. I guess it fits my voice, I guess. I don't know. Third question. What are your top two favorite collectibles? Um, number one is definitely my Illidan statue because it's awesome. And my second one, it's very difficult because I have so many collectibles. Um, I have... A Yoshi of every color. I have um, plushies. I have amiibos. I have One Piece figures. I have a card capture Sakura figure. I have an Ace Attorney figure. Um, I guess it would probably be this one here. It's Okabe from Steins Gate. If you haven't seen Steins Gate, watch it because it's really awesome. And I really like this Figma because I can like pose him however I want and I constantly have him on my desk in his mad scientist pose because yeah, I love him. Fourth question, how many years have you been a gamer? Um, since I was three years old, so a really long time. Fifth question, if you designed a game, what genre would it be? And describe a tiny bit about it. Um, if I made a game, it would probably be a visual novel, kind of like Ace Attorney, because I really like games that are story heavy and have characters that are well developed. And I like puzzles and yeah, I like stuff like that. So that's probably what I would make. Okay, there's two questions left. First one is from Kirill. What was the first game you fell in love with and why? Oof, that's a difficult question. Because I like a lot of games. What was the first game I fell in love with? That's a really good question. Because I mean, I started playing when I was a little kid, so I liked pretty much every game equally. I mean, like, I really liked Mario, I really liked Castlevania. I really like Bubble Bobble, um, I really like Mega Man, um, so I don't think I really like fell in love with the game until like later. Um, I would say probably Ace Attorney, like that's nowhere near the first game that I played, but it's the first game that made me interested in the fandom I guess because like usually I would play a game and I would finish it and then like I'd be like oh like that game was cool and that be that be it but um, when I played Ace Attorney um, I liked it so much like it made me cry and everything and I cared like so much about the characters that I felt like I really needed more so I kind of went online and found... That's when I really like found out about fandom and all that. And that's when I started <laughs> reading fanfiction. Um, and I know that there's like a lot of really bad fanfiction online. But there's also a lot of really good ones. So yeah, probably Ace Attorney.
The last question comes from TalonJ98. What is your favorite thing to do for fun and wow? Making videos doesn't count. Okay, um... I spend a lot of time raiding, but I guess that's just something that... Not that I have to do, but I mean, I'm in a raiding guild, so that's just something that's expected of me, I guess. So I guess something that I do for fun between raids, I'd say achievement hunting. I'm currently at... 20,405 achievement points. So yeah, I really like achievements. <laughs> I didn't realize how shiny my forehead was. It's kind of cool. I have the power of the Naru. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much again for the 200 subscribers. We're already past 250 now, so that's kind of crazy. Um, if you have any questions about how I made my horns or any other part of my costume, or if you have questions for my next Q&A, leave them in the comments below. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. My tentacles are crooked. <laughs>